The contested land is over 1,000 acres and covers six villages, including Kamsene, Kankoba, and Chitwala, among others, all located in Chiriandongo district. Residents here claim that Chiriandongo Sugar Company plans to evict them without compensation. They disclosed the matter to the land's minister, Betty Kamia, in a meeting she convened to bring the two parties to the table. We were surprised by graders and tractors and excavators which came on the ground at the time with some bags loaded with some money and the surveyors. They could come, survey your land, that very day when you are there, tell you the amount they could think about and ask if you are willing to take it, they pay you, there and then the grader demolishes what is on the ground. But then to me as a councillor, what is going on? I went there and to intervene what was going on. The next thing was just to say is me and put in the cover. And I was like, what, what are you doing? I am a councillor, I'm coming to, to see what is going on on behalf of the people. They said this one who does not fear a gun here, put her in the cover. They put me in the Kavangadi, eight people on top of me. And they were saying, press her because she's maybe a rebel or what. I said, I'm a cancer. Many residents here are pastoralists, but claim all roads that lead to drinking points for their cattle have been blocked by the investors. The investor has even gone in to the river. And they can ask still, the investor has planted the sugar cane. But we are still left there. But again, he should stop coming again to dig where we are, to bring confusion. It said that there is a memorandum of understanding between government and the investors, which has not been honored since signing. They, they, they spoke of the churches, spoke of the schools, spoke of the roads, the health sector. But nothing is done there. The environment, we are there suffering with the sunshine. They never planted anything to, to control the environment. The investors were not represented in the meeting in which Kamiya promised to follow up the issue to its conclusion. So we have agreed that for now there's going to be no more evictions until we solve these problems. And as soon as possible, I shall convene a meeting in Kampala with the Chilean local leaders and the security leaders and the, and the leaders of this district to resolve this matter.